Welcome to the series of Blender Tutorials. This tutorial is about getting Blender 2.59 and how to install and run Blender 2.59 on the Windows operating system. For this tutorial, I am using Windows XP operating system. This script has been contributed by Chirag Raman and edited by Monisha Banerjee. Open your internet browser. I am using Firefox 3.09. In the address bar type www.blender.org and hit the enter key. This should take you to the official Blender website. Blender is free and open source. The installer or source code is available for download from the Blender website. Here is a download Blender link right below the header of the page. We shall click on this link to take us to the download page. As you can see, this is the latest stable version of Blender. You have two options here. A 32-bit or 64-bit installer. You can download any one depending on which is applicable to your machine. To understand about 32-bit and 64-bit systems, see our tutorial on Blender Hardware Requirements. The website also provides a zipped archive of the Blender program files. This archive contains all files required to run Blender. You would need to unzip and extract the files to a folder of your choice and run the Blender executable. Let me demonstrate. The main difference between installer and archive is that the installer places the Blender application files in C drive program files and sets up an icon in the start menu an icon on the desktop and opens dot blend files with blender by default while the zip archive has all the application files and the executable blender file in one single folder which can be copied to any drive on the computer now if i want to use the archive for my machine i need 32 bit archive Left click on the download link for the 32-bit archive and download starts. As I said before, my internet browser is Firefox 3.09. The download steps shown here are similar in all other internet browsers. You can see here the download progress. This horizontal download bar with the green vertical strips shows how much download is done. The download speed depends on your internet connection. Please wait until it is completed. To extract the archive, first right click on the download. Left click open containing folder. Left double click on the zip. It will open in an archiver like WinZip which is installed by default on any Windows machine. Left click on extract. Choose your destination folder from the list. I am extracting to my documents. Left click extract. This progress bar with the green strips shows how much extraction is done. Now you can see the extracted folder on your screen. Left double click to open the folder. 
Let's double click the Blender executable. Windows throws up a security warning. The publisher could not be verified. This is nothing to worry about. Just click on the button run. You are good to go. Now, if you want to use the installer, let's go back to the Blender website. Click on download at the top of the page. This takes us back to the download page. For my machine, I need 32-bit installer. So, I left click on the download link for 32-bit installer and download starts. For ease of demonstration, I have already downloaded the installer from the Blender website onto my machine. I shall now walk you through the installation steps. Left double click the installer. Windows throws up a security warning. The publisher could not be verified. This is nothing to worry about. Just click on the button run. So this is what the Blender Setup Wizard looks like. Click on Next here to take you to the next step in the installation process. As with most softwares, the installer shows a license agreement. Press Page Down to see the rest of the agreement. I advise you to read this thoroughly. Do note that Blender is free and open source. You must accept this license agreement to install Blender. Now, click on the I agree button to continue. This next step allows you to choose components to install. I advise you to install all the components selected by default and hit the next button to continue the installation. So here you have the option to choose install location for Blender. By default, the program files folder is selected, which is a good location to install Blender. So go ahead and hit the install button. This progress bar with the green strips shows how much of the installation is completed. Usually, it takes less than a minute to complete. This completes the Blender setup. Blender has been installed on your machine. Keep the Run Blender checkbox selected. Hit the Finish button. Blender should automatically start running. Provided the Blender binary is in the original extracted directory, Blender will run straight out of the box without additional dependencies. No system libraries or system preferences are altered. So in this tutorial, we have learned how to install Blender on a Windows operating system. Now, try to download Blender from the Blender website and install and run Blender on your machine. This tutorial is created by Project Oscar and supported by the National Mission on Education through ICT. More information on the same is available at the following links oscar.iitb.ac.in and spoken-tutorial.org slash nme ict dash intro Thanks for joining us. And this is Manisha from IIT Bombay signing off.